Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the Cinderella Diary. So today I will be discussing my entry into NYU's Performing Arts Essentials Program brought to you by Yellow Brick. Yeah, I'm so excited. <laughs> Your girl is going to be a performer, okay? So yes, I got in the program and I also got a scholarship. So um, I wrote this uh, like this uh, short essay to get in and I just talked about my passion for film for TV and how I was in one of their other courses and that I was going to do all I can to make sure that um, everybody knew about their brand and about this course and I was just proud to be a part of it and my long-term goals and my short-term goals as well and how I wanted to be an entrepreneur as well. That was an extra perk. And I got a scholarship. Um, the Yellow Brick Committee um, sent me this email. And they said that I didn't have to pay um, <laughs> the full price of the course. Which was a little pricey right now for me. So I got to pay half of what they were asking for this scholarship. And that is really great. It's not that expensive um, if you don't get the scholarship. But um, apply. You know, because it's beneficial um yeah so i started the course and i'm excited i never thought that i would get into performing arts i was always behind the scenes type of girl um i wanted to become a better writer and so when i took their film and tv course it was helping me to learn the film industry you know key definitions and um just how to what's what i'm going to expect on when i go into um on set and different things like that um what to the lingos to use um what shots i need to use and you know, just all that good stuff, how to write a script and all of it. I mean, it's been remarkable. This course, I'm like, this is like a cheat sheet. I mean, it's exactly what I needed. I've been trying to write write a screenplay and a script for like a long time. And I've been researching books and looking online for the formats. And here I found this course where they give me everything the go and go for like how I should start and also being able to watch videos of people at NYU and also in the industry has been like a remarkable experience as well. So I decided to apply to the performing arts because, you know, I'm on TikTok and I do YouTube and different things like that. And I've been just having fun just acting and singing and dancing and, you know, connecting all of those things together. So when I saw this course, I was like, I don't know, you know, I, I'm not, this is not for me, but it's exactly what it's, it's exactly what's for me. I mean, I love performing arts. I love drama and theater and movies and film. And, um, you know, I want to be a writer in the industry, but I also wouldn't mind getting in front of the camera. I'm starting to not be afraid um you know taking that harvard course about um persuasive writing and public speaking helped me be more confident in um who i am and um and to go after things like this i'm just i i can't believe that this is my life right now i can't believe that i'm actually going after these goals um i'm super excited and i can't wait to tell you more about it i just started the course so i don't want to give you too much about what's going on and i want you guys to go and enjoy it and have fun for yourself but um it's just been really great it's been helping me become a confident actor and also a more um f fluent speaker and writer so now that I know the industries and the perks of in and out, what they're looking for and how to act on stage and how to bring a character to life um, through myself and also through writing, it's just been beneficial. Um, I can't believe that I'm sitting here talking about this. Um, I can't believe that this is my life and that I'm actually going for this because this is, you know, I'm the shy girl. I don't go after things like this. I just kind of write and let everybody else you know, play with my words and everything like that. But, you know, I just got tired of that. I wanted to finally do something that I love. I always dreamt of being in front of the screen and being, you know, the, the main character, but I didn't think that I had what it takes. But in this course, it's teaching me that I do. Um, you know, I'm learning to talk slower and to be more confident and just be comfortable in my skin and who I am. And, you know, I'm this outcast, this weirdo. I've always felt like that in my whole entire life. And when I'm in this course, and when I'm reading about it and I'm doing the work, I just feel like I'm at home and I'm finding my my soul tribe, my family. So it's been just really cool just to be a part of this. I'm excited. Um, I just, I feel so happy. I'm so, so happy. And if you are an artist, if you are, you know, in the arts industry and you don't know how to get your feet wet, start this course. And I promise you, it'll light a fire in you. You'll start to get more information out there. I've been doing workshops. I've been looking at film schools and everything's like that because I know like, okay, I'm capable of doing this and I can do this. And this is my path. This is my purpose on earth. And I love to write. I love love stories. I want to be in a romance movie. Oh, I, that's my dream. 
I want to dance, maybe do Broadway. You know, I never would say these things because I never thought I could actually accomplish these things, um, especially being just where I come from and especially being a woman of color. I was always afraid to go after these things because you always hear that there's like a glass ceiling that, you know, you can't get over this, that, you know, you have to be rare and different that everybody, not one of us, not all of us make it, you know, like I kept hearing those things. You can't do it. You know, you're not pretty enough. All these things that I kept hearing and I'm too tall and, you know, just all these things. And I just had to shut those people out, ignore those people, cut those people off and go after my dreams. And people are actually acknowledging me. People in the industry, I'm going to workshops and I'm going to um, meetings on Zoom and I'm meeting directors, you know, who have done big movies and they wanted to speak to me. They're pointing me out. They're like, wow, you know, I love your hair. And, you know, wanting to, you know, they know my name and different things like that. And I never thought that that would happen. But because I made these moves and because I joined this course, um, this NYU course brought to by Yellow Brick and NYU Tish of Arts, um, because I've done this and I put my put my first, you know, put my feet forward um, into the door when it comes to the art industry that I am starting to realize that I am here and I am home and I'm excited. I can't wait to do more on YouTube, more on TikTok and just more, you know, just entertaining because I love to entertain and I didn't realize that was my passion um, until now and this year, um, just sitting at home and um, not wanting to just sit in the house and not do anything and being a stay at home mom and a military wife while my husband is away I just thought like I should just do this I should just go out and do it and see if you know this is what I'm passionate about you know at first it was like are, are there people gonna like me are people going to accept me and different things like that and then I got past that like who cares I like me I like who I am and if I am you know confident in, in myself and I know how to portray the character or I know how to portray the you know um, the characters in my stories, then people will, you know, accept that. And, you know, I have to sell myself. And, you know, in order to sell myself, I have to be confident in who I am and confident in my character and my flaws and, you know, my mistakes and learning and being a leader and, you know, apologizing for things and not knowing things and, you know, having outbursts, but then like, you know, apologizing for that. It's all about that, you know, that's what comes with being, um, you know, a performer and, you know, a person that's in the arts, a star. Um, I can't believe that I'm just saying this about myself because I, I mean, I did not have any confidence before this. And this program has given me all the confidence in the world and it's made me see myself in a different light. And I'm just so thankful that I found this program. Um, the course is, um, you know, it doesn't take long to accomplish. I'm going to be probably take a year to do it because, you know, I'm a, I'm a mom at, you know, and I'm a mom and I do other things as well. So I'm going to try to like pace myself and also just learn everything that I'm incorporating um, into my everyday life and just do it as a slow pace. You know, I still have a, I have a year to complete, so there's no rush. And um, I'm excited that this is this is happening. So if you are interested in the arts industry, if you are a performer, you want to be on Broadway, you want to be an actor, an actress, you want to write, a director, whatever the case may be, take this performing arts course because it will help you. You will you need to know all the aspects of the business in the industry so don't think because you're not a performer to be a director or you're an editor you know you're low-key or behind the scenes that you don't need to know these things but really you do and it will help you and it'll keep that fire lit and give, give you that passion to keep going because sometimes in this industry everything is not guaranteed so you have to keep that fire lit you know so yeah, I hope that this was informative and I hope that you feel inspired. Um, I will talk more about the program if you want me to. Just comment below and just thank you so much for subscribing. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and tell all your girlfriends about the Cinderella Diaries. And I promise the videos will get more interesting. I'll start vlogging more and doing all types of greatness. You know, just right now I'm just, you know, with quarantine kind of easing up a little bit and all my coursework being at home and my husband being on the employment um it's just been easy for me to just be in the house and sit and talk in front of the camera but i promise it'll get better it'll get more interesting so thank you for staying with me um uh this has been a blast so thank you so much your girl loves you so much and i'm so proud of all of you for taking the first steps in your life and your career to become a performer and thank you so much for um coming along in my journey so yeah thank you and yeah don't forget to hit that subscribe button okay and share 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 all right love you guys bye